Hello everyone, this is Ardwick. Uh, we are continuing our adventures into space. We need a little bit more science to do what I want to do next, uh, which is to do a satellite experiment. So, in order to do that, I've quickly concocted this Goddard 3.0. I'm surprised actually that I was doing another Goddard mission, but uh, it might be kind of fun. Uh, I have equipped two science juniors to this uh, vessel that should... Um, be able to yield uh, some more science because we haven't really used these uh, science juniors that much. Um, before I launch this thing, I want to do what I did last time and put some uh, parachutes on this. We only need two. I think we might only need one, but I'd like to have two because it's a nice stable thing that'll land flat on its surface. Uh, let me just check my staging here. These should not be the first things to launch. Those should decouple at the same time as this one here. So the parachute launches last, our two parachutes, and this guy release at the same time. And then this thruster also launches as well. We... I, I was about to repeat the same mistake I did made before. Which is, I need a decoupler. Right about uh, here. So we're going to launch this mission twice, once to land in the water and once to land in the grasslands. This first mission is going to be for the water, hence why there are no landers on this thing. There we are. Uh, free science. That's not too bad. I was hoping for more, but I've seen worse. Okay, so we are now officially out of thrust. And, with that being said, I am now going to dislodge part one. Part two consists of the science experiment. Oop, there goes part one. Look at that. That is so cool. Look at you tumbling away. I love the physics in this game. Uh, I'm actually going to reset the materials bay and try this one more time just to see if we get any different result up here. Ah, nice! The upper atmosphere. Okay, that's much that's much better. We're going to keep that data. In fact, just to ensure that it's going to survive, I'm going to deploy this parachute now. Oh, hold on. That was not what I was expecting to do. We're going to quickly throttle down because we have an emergency situation. We are going to go to the... Oh, no, we cannot. Uh, hold on. Can I actually salvage that piece before it gets too far? Nope, no, no, hold on. Oh, it might be too late to salvage. That's going to be node 3. Uh, dang it. It might be unsalvageable. I'm going to deploy our parachute. Oh dear. Is this not going to deploy? Are we in trouble? I think we are. Oh, there it goes. Oh, thank goodness! It deployed after all. Okay. So we weren't in danger. I think it's just because I deployed the parachute so early up in the atmosphere that, um... Th yeah, okay, so we're good. And that right there is the stage the Goddard debris that we did not attach a parachute to. So we're good. Okay, I was panicking for a second, but we're okay. I actually really wish we could zoom into some of the debris. Oh, that one's gone. It looks like that one. I believe that one just flat out exploded. Where did our other parachute of debris go? Did we leave it way high up in the atmosphere? I don't know. Okay. Actually, you know what? Real quick, I'm going to check our other debris just to see if I can tell where it went. Although I might not be able to until we actually land... There we go. It's a nice, safe 
landing, at least for this node. We are really far away from our initial launch point, actually. That's all the way over there. It may have landed so far away that I wasn't able to keep track of it. We'll have to find out. But I know I, lo I saw the parachutes on it deploy. I really hope that piece survives, because that was 17 signs. That's enough to get us to where we need to go alone. Okay. Well, we deployed here at least, so let's check the materials bay in the water. Ten science. So, we're good here. Uh, I'm gonna quickly recover this vessel. And then see if we can recover the debris that we left behind. Uh, let's see, debris? No, it didn't work. Oh no, we lost our other piece. What happened to it? I think it deployed way too early. Oh well. So I think what I should have done that early, but I, I, I really should have waited until we were in the atmosphere to drop it, because I think if you release it too early, you'll lose the debris piece. Okay, quickly, before we get too far down... Oh wait, no, this one. This is the one that we need to have protected. There we go. We're going to keep that data. But we're not going to be hasty and launch this part away prematurely. We're going to wait, because we are patient people. And it should be safe to release now. There we go. And now I'm going to launch my own parachute and my landing gear. All right. And I'm going to click that so I can keep track of it. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Yes. Good. There we go. Perfect. And there's our debris piece, too. I'm going to observe our materials bay while we're here. 7.5 science. This was worth it. Even if the other part doesn't work, it was worth it. Even though it should work, because I did everything that I was supposed to do. So let's wait for it to come back down. Or actually, you know what? I am going to recover this vessel now. give us 7.5 science. I'm going to go to the tracking station, track our debris, and now we can watch it from the debris perspective. Oh no! Why didn't the parachute deploy? That's bollocks! I swear there was a parachute on that thing! I'll have to review the footage early to see what went wrong. But we can at least buy our next piece that we wanted to buy, our next science, if you will, which is space exploration. We are going to buy this piece right here because it gives us a processing lab. It gives us a mobility enhancer, which are ladders, and it gives us the thermometer, all of which are useful for our next scientific endeavors. We are going to build a satellite next. But before we do, I want to review the footage to see what went, what went wrong with that last launching. So I'm going to end the video here. It's a little short, admittedly. Um, and we'll get back to you guys next time. Until then, this is Ardwick. Stay tuned, and good night.